and by Republicans in the House to increase the federal debt limit and also cut federal spending. Joel Brown following that, standing by now to walk us through the developments and what's in the plan. Joel? Yeah, Amber, Steve, the ultimate goal of this plan is to raise the nation's borrowing limit by one and a half trillion dollars. This is not about spending new money. It's about paying the bills the country's already racked up. House Speaker Kevin McCarthy has to get the deal done before the looming summer default deadline. But as with most, thi most things on Capitol Hill, there's a debate over what's included. Some of the points of contention in McCarthy's proposal. Most people would only get food stamps for three months out of every three years unless they are employed at least 20 hours a week. According to one estimate, that means as many as 275,000 Americans could lose benefits each month. The package would also require certain adult Medicaid recipients to work or perform community service for at least 80 hours a month. That provision would result in about one and a half million adults losing federal funding for Medicaid coverage. The debt ceiling would also make changes to the work requirement provisions of the Temporary Assistance for Needy Families program, which was created in 1996. Republicans see this as a way to reduce government spending and bolster the nation's labor force, but Democrats and the White House say those proposed changes would make the deal dead on arrival. I'm happy to meet with McCarthy, but not on whether or not the debt limit gets extended. That's not negotiable. This agreement must be reached because we must never default, and the agreement needs to be reached between the Speaker and the President. So still at a standoff here because of the debate, even if House Republicans pass the measure today, it is highly unlikely to pass the Democratic-led Senate. However, it would be a symbolic win for House Speaker McCarthy to unite Republican leadership. We've got our eyes on the feeds from Capitol Hill, a vote expected at any moment. When news happens, we'll turn it around for you. Amber, Steve.